sketchbook challenge number 16. Today is birds. Hanging out with me today is Kristen Rose Merlot, and we are going to, we're gonna do some bird hunt, well not bird hunting, but bird watching. We're gonna see if we can discover some really unique exotic birds, hopefully in my backyard, and then we are gonna come back inside and draw them. Maybe what we can do, we can use our phones and take photos if we're really quiet and sneak around. I know there's all kinds of, I've seen hawks back there and blue jays, woodpeckers. Oh my gosh, when I'm trying to take an afternoon nap, there is a woodpecker. They say woodpeckers are good for insects, but oh my gosh, the little, you know, the... You might even hear a warbler. A warbler? A warbler. A warbler. Oh my gosh, I'm excited. Let's go, let's go bird watching. Come on. Did you hear that? You heard that, right? Or is that just me? I heard it. Is it okay? All right, so clearly we didn't have any luck bird watching outside. I don't know, maybe our ninja skills aren't up to par. You Probably know, not. With the noise, the trampling through the leaves and stuff. So instead, we're gonna use our pal Google and we are going to draw some epic birds for you guys. Here's some tips and tricks, come on. So what are you gonna Google, just birds? I'm gonna Google exotic birds. Bird is also an English term for lady, so if you're not careful, exotic bird might yield you some That's why Koreans. I searches on. I'm gonna start by locking out like rough little shapes of, but I kinda squint, what does the shape of the bird look like? Kinda like a loaf of bread, with the head coming out of it. a little strange without drawing the branch, the actual branch that it's holding on to. I dated a girl that had a parrot, I think. They poo all over the place and it just, it gets so far away from where their cage is. But the neat thing about the birds is at nighttime, you just put a blanket over their cage and they instantly become quiet. So this warbler has this really crazy color pattern on it. Kind of breaking these down into basic shapes here. So I'm gonna draw one more bird here. Oh, I wanna do a bird in flight. Here's this here. stand out a little bit more so it isn't just birds floating in the middle of the white matrix. Right now it's a little too like blobby shaped so I'm adding in just little bits of what could be leaves either glistening or like kind of exceeding these little edges here so it isn't so perfect graphic shape in the background just adds a little bit of just makes it a little bit more organic. It is Big Bird, isn't it? Yeah, it's Big Bird. I mean, it came up in my Google search. All right, so drawing birds is a lot of fun, don't you think? Like the feathers and the textures and stuff? Oh yeah, tons of fun. 
So I want you guys to fill a page from top to bottom, from side to side. It could be a scene with a bunch of birds in it. It could just be random birds, like studies that almost look like a scientific kind of scenario going on. I want you to have fun with birds. And don't forget that the hashtag that you're gonna post with these today is SBC Birds, in addition to uh, sketchbook challenge. Also, while Kristen is writing that down, I want you guys to give this a like if you like this video. Hopefully you do. Also, in the comments, I've been forgetting to tell you guys to leave me a comment saying challenge accepted. Uh, so you should be doing that for all of these videos, whether I tell you to or not. We want to know what you guys think of our birds. What's the favorite bird that you saw either Kristen or I drew? This one right here. Whoops, sorry, you're all right. Crash! Yeah, we're fine. This this one right here is my fave. I want you guys to let us know what you liked best. Plus, you should always subscribe. You should smash that notification bell and you should share because you care. Plus, you're gonna find me on Instagram, but also Kristen Rose Merlot's Instagram. You should definitely follow her as well. I'll leave that down in the comments below. So you, a link so that you can click onto it and follow her channel on Instagram. Plus, look her up on YouTube. I'll yes. leave that as well. Rock and roll.